Hello everyone, this is EKB News reporter Shelby Porter here. I'm currently in South Williamson at the floodgate. As you can see behind me, the river is up. It is currently at 29.75. Um, I spoke with fish officials in Pike County and they say they are planning to close the floodgates here in South Williamson once it reaches about 35 or 36 inches. The flood stage is at 38, so they are planning beforehand, you know, to close the gates here in South Williamson. As I said earlier, it is currently at 29.75. It is not raining right now, so hopefully it doesn't continue to rain and we will stay at 29.75. But again, the flood stage is 38, and they are planning to close the floodgates here in South Williamson once it reaches 35 or 36. I haven't seen any reports from damages to buildings. If you know of any, please send them my way. But currently, it's just a lot of standing water in the roads. I know at Turkey Creek, there's standing water, Narrows Branch, Macar. There's just anywhere that you know that there's usually standing water there's it's pretty much there so just be careful when you're out you know do not drive through the water i've seen a lot of videos of people driving through the water to get video or pictures please do not do that do not drive through the water because you don't know how stable the road is underneath it so just please be careful if you see water turn around don't drown and again, for I see a lot of people that are just tuning in with us. I'm standing here in South Williamson at the floodgate here. The flood stage is 38, but currently we are at 29.75. Pike County officials are planning to close the floodgates once it gets to 35 or 36 inches. So again, we're not there yet, but I will keep you updated. It's currently not raining. So hopefully it'll stay that way and it will continue to go down. But as of now, it's continuing to rise. It's at 29.75. The flood stage is at 38 inches and we will close the floodgates here in South Williamson at 35 or 36 inches. So continue to stay here on EKB News Facebook page on the radio stations of East Kentucky Broadcasting and we'll keep you updated as quickly as possible and just continue to stay tuned with us and we'll update you with what we know.